Was it hard for you to make the transition from from doing news to being on on the View? I mean, it's something I'm you know I'm curious for myself because yeah. I mean, it's, it's it is an interesting transition and to do them both. Well, I really credit Richard because I I wasn't even going to audition for the View, and at that point I was a reporter who didn't want to really travel anymore. And Richard was the one who said, "Look." You, you, you don't want to do what you've been trained to do, so why not at least look at this mm -hmm. as an option? And I went for the audition. It was held in a, a hotel room. It was Barbara. They auditioned you in a hotel oh, room? Oh, yeah, really? yeah, yeah. Well, not like you're thinking. I mean, it was, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, God knows I wouldn't do that. You may have slept your way to this job, well, but not me. Well, you know, listen, yeah, I, I listened whatever to you it takes. Beginning. Exactly. <laughs> but it was Barbara, me, Joy, Star Jones uh, in that first group and Debbie Matinopoulos, and they auditioned many, many more, but they came back to the original group. Uh -huh. And I left that audition thinking, oh, I'm embarrassed, I like this. Uh -huh. you know? And they were thinking I'd get the job, and then I did, but it, it was when you When you were with that group, did you know instantly, okay, this is the group it's gonna be? No, not at all. Uh -huh. No, I thought there was a certain chemistry, which is you know, essential to that right. kind of a ensemble, but I, I never would have predicted it, um, and then, was lucky enough to get the job. Yeah. But it's hard to go from being the objective news person to interjecting your personality right. and your opinion right. every chance you get. And I was a little bit over the top, yeah. like a loose animal. I would say things like, <laughs> like bizarre things would come out of my mouth because I just wanted to talk. <laughs>